In October of 2016, Apple released the Thunderbolt 3 MacBook Pro capable of powering quad 4K displays. Over seven months later, Belkin finally released their powered Thunderbolt 3 dock. Can this new dock deliver on the promise of providing quad 4K, power, ethernet, and USB, all from two docks and just two cables? Let's take a look. We ordered two docks for $350 each from Belkin's website. Inside the box, we find a Thunderbolt 3 dock, a power adapter, and a 3-foot Thunderbolt 3 cable. Each dock is capable of dual 4K video output. The dock also lets you connect up to eight separate devices and daisy chain up to five Thunderbolt devices. At 40 gigabits per second, Thunderbolt 3 promises to maintain full speed when fully loaded and running multiple peripherals at once. The dock features three USB 3.0 Type-A ports, two USB-C Thunderbolt 3 ports, an Ethernet port, audio in and out, and a display port. Crucially for power users with demanding workloads, Belkin's dock supplies 85 watts of charging power, just like Apple's charging adapter that comes included with the 15-inch MacBook Pro. We paired these docks with four Dell P2415Q 24-inch 4K displays. For mounting, we used our usual favorite, the planar quad monitor stand. And lastly, to cradle our MacBook Pro, we're using 12 South's aluminum book arc upright stand for MacBooks. Laptop closed display mode and sleep wake now both work very well in Mac OS Sierra version 10.12.5. All four monitors operate at 60 Hertz using DisplayPort. We also found the Balkan's stability and performance to be superior to the CalDigit TS3 Lite that we reviewed on this channel back in February. The biggest problem we observed was that occasionally, after sleeping and undocking, the MacBook Pro tends to wake up very slowly. Impatient users may think that the computer has locked up, but so far, the MacBook Pro always wakes up as long as we wait long enough. macOS stability for Quad 4K Thunderbolt 3 docking has improved this year. Using the Belkin, we continue to observe occasional bugs where the MacBook Pro wakes by itself, where graphics don't display properly unless we undock and redock, and where the screen resolution changes by itself. We're hopeful that this setup will be stable enough for production tasks. Be sure to check back in the video description below in the future for our long-term updates and for our final recommendation. Stay tuned for more Geekster Owl videos coming soon where we'll be reviewing the Nintendo Switch Mega Bundle, cheap portable Linux servers, the Dell PowerEdge T30 server, the EVE light switch for Apple HomeKit, the Klipsch R20B soundbar, a new KB Lake Hackintosh, the 43-inch LG 43UD78B computer monitor, and the Apple external GPU enclosure. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please like or subscribe and leave comments below. Also, consider getting subscribed to our new music channel, Geekster Robot. And so long, until next time.